Hi everyone, so this video is going to be a little bit random, but I did one of these a little while ago and you guys seem to really enjoy it, so I thought I would do one again. And it's a home bargains haul. For those of you who don't know what home bargains is, um, it's kind of a... I don't want to say it's a junk shop because it actually has decent stuff in it. It's sort of like a discounted, you can find most things in it kind of store. They have food, they have cleaning products, they have homeware, they have like cosmetics, it's that kind of thing. Um, my boyfriend struggles hugely to tell the difference between that and B&M. He always calls both of them B&M and when I corrected him in the car today and said home bargains, he said, yeah, but it's the same <laughs> as B&M, which it pretty much is. Um, but I've got some cleaning products, I've got some random stuff. I'm gonna just show you everything that I've bought because it is quite an interesting selection of stuff. Um, some of it is boring stuff, cleaning products, but I like watching cleaning product kind of thing, so you might enjoy it, but there is some bits of beauty, some, it's very random. Um, so, I bought, this actually isn't for me, because I already have one, but I bought one of these Dishmatic dish washing um, brush thingies. I like these the best, because it doesn't get your hands all gross, and you can kind of hold it quite far away, and it's kind of a bit gross when you're touching food in that. Um, and I got two of these for my brother, because he said that he needed one. Um, so I bought him one, but for me, I did buy some more heads for our one and I bought the black ones because I thought they looked a bit nicer so um yeah <laughs> that's that fascinating purchase then I've got a couple of kind of beauty things just that I can see here I bought some toothpaste because we needed some new toothpaste this is the deep clean whitening toothpaste from Colgate um I think I might have tried this toothpaste before actually I don't know if I have Anyway, it just looks like that, it's toothpaste. I'm not too picky with toothpaste, toothpaste to be honest, but I knew that I did need some. Um, then, I didn't put this in here, my boyfriend put this in, some deodorant, his favourite deodorant, so that's in here. Um, this is really fun, I got this Tarte Burner, um, like wax melt thingy, which looks like this, because I thought it was really, really pretty, and I have got one from there before that I don't like, that I think isn't very good quality, but this seems a little bit nicer. Um, so we'll see. I'll see how I feel about it, if it melts things, but I just thought the design was really pretty and because of the holes I thought it would kind of look pretty with a tea light in it. So I'll see how I get on with that. Um, and to go with that, I purchased, there's another one of these in here somewhere which I'll probably find in a minute, but everyone's been raving about these unstoppable wax melts. So I purchased the spring ones, um, suitable for warmer, but I presume you can put them in a regular one. I have got two electric warmers as well. so. I will be using it for those. Oh, and he dropped it. it. Smells really, really good. Really good, like clean, fresh laundry kind of smell. Lovely. Um, I then also got this one from. This is Airwick. I haven't tried this before, and it's the Vanilla Treats Cupcake Whipped Cream and Raspberry Jam. And these were like really, really inexpensive. Mm, they, they don't smell as good as the other one. They just smell like um like vanilla but kind of I like those kinds of scents like in a kitchen for example I think they're quite nice so yeah we, we'll see how I get on with that um but I thought I'd give those a go um what else do we have in here a beauty item I bought some batiste um coconut and exotic tropical batiste because I just needed some more dry shampoo and I saw that in there I don't actually know what this smells like a tiny bit in the lid. Mmm. Coconut and sun cream. Oh my god, that smells gorgeous. I definitely will be using that. Um, then what else do we have here? To <laughs> I put this to wash dishes with. I don't know why, but it looked interesting. It's a soap dispensing dish brush, and I thought it'd be good for trays because it looks quite abrasive. I picked that up. Um, then I picked this up because I had seen lots and lots of people raving about this and I just had to try it and it is the 101, 101 um, Carpet Fresh and this is in Frosted Winter Berries. You spray it on your carpets and that kind of thing and it makes them smell good. I just fancy trying it. it smells really good. It's limited edition um, and we're moving house so I'm well into making our new house more lovely and fresh um, because I'm just so bored of this stupid house. Well I'm not bored of it, I'm just fed up of it being freezing cold and maintained. 
Um, I also bought one of these guest lighters. We lose slash run out of these just all the time. Um, they're really good for candles, but I don't know what happens to them. They just get lost very easily. So I bought another one of those. It was like 99p and we did actually need one. Then, um, okay. I've got a bunch of these. I'm only going to show you one because they're not mine, but my boyfriend put these in here. They're his favourite mints in the entire world and he buys like five every time he goes in there because they're cheaper um, and they're not super easy to get hold of. They're the Smint Sugar Free Mints. So they're mints. I don't care about them. Um, speaking of random things, let me show you. Oh, he's put stuff in here without me even like, knowing. These are definitely not me. Not that I don't like Maltesers, I do like Maltesers. I just try to not eat them. Um, he put these in here, there's two of them, because he is obsessed with Malteser. And don't even get me started on the fact that it's a running joke that he's from Malta and it's like the Malteser who loves Maltesers. You can see that now and it looks annoying. I'll move it, you can still see it a bit, but whatever. Um, I also got some more of those wax melt things. Um, this is in the shade Fresh. Haven't smelt these ones, so the Unstoppables. Um, nice, but I think I prefer the spring ones, but they're still nice, I'll still use them. Um, yeah, I think that's really nice, like the way the packaging of this goes. It's like it's, it's just quite satisfying, isn't it? I'm going to break one of these out in a minute and put one in my wax burner downstairs. Um, what else do we have in here? Uh, 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 oh. Last but not least, I'm going to show you. Well, two things that were not for me were these, who put these in here? Me, cheddar, smoked cheddar, I don't like those, um, and some regular M&Ms. But, some snacks that I did buy were these, because let me tell you, these are delicious, and they're only 109 calories a pack, and if you like crisp, they're the Ritz Cream Cream cheese and onion flavour. These are so, so nice. This, they do sort of vinegar ones. They're not as nice as these ones. These are really, really yummy. Um, so, yeah, I bought some of those because that seems to be the only place that ever stocks them. So, that's that. But I think, yeah, that is everything. I hope you enjoyed this. It was the most random thing ever. I am going to do like a cleaning product kind of haul soon because I need to order some stuff for our. Um, for the new house and for like getting things sorted and that kind of thing um and we also kind of do need to get this house clean before we leave which i'm not looking forward to um because it's just so run down but you know obviously for deposit reasons we need to do that so yeah but i hope you enjoyed this video nonetheless and i will um see you in my next video when this video goes up we will have moved already i'm not sure what our internet situation is so when you're seeing this we're probably already in the new house but we should have internet quite soon and i wanted to have a video to be able to upload upload once we do have the internet right now we're still in the old house so it's all a bit kind of like mind um I was going to say a naughty word, but like, you know what I mean. Um, yeah, so we'll see how quick my new internet is. I'm so hoping that it's what we had last time and it's fine. Um, you know how they can promise you a certain speed, but it's kind of, you're not entirely sure how accurate that is. Um, but yeah, so we will, we will see. Um, but I'm looking forward to being in the new house and it just being like nice and easy to manage. But um, yeah, other than that, I will see you all very soon. I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know if you like these kinds of hauls. I need to go to B&M soon and buy a couple of bits as well so I can um, show you that when I do that. But I will love you and leave you and um, yeah, see you soon. Bye. Mm -hmm.